طيب يعطيكم العافية. We we started with um, lung cancer on Monday. وقلنا إنه lung cancer is an epithelial tumor and that uh, it's divided mainly into small cell lung cancer and non-small cell lung cancer. We discussed the differences in terms of histology, prognosis, incidence, and then we started talking about non-small cell lung carcinoma. Well, now, you know, this is um, a solid cancer that follows the DNM staging. So we have a, a yearly disease like stage one and two, and we have stage three disease, and we have the advanced or metastatic stage four disease. And we said that the treatment is dependent on stage B in non-metastatic settings or the um, three and three A phases of, of the disease. So Hakena and surgery is mainstay is very important in stage one and two. Well, now, you know, uh, with, with certain cases in stage uh, two, we might also consider just radiotherapy. وحكينا إنه ب بال بالأجوبت تريتمنت أو بالأجوبت كيموثيرابي بلاتينوم دبلت is usually as the preferred um, chemotherapeutic choice. So إنه إنه دبلتس we can have um, platinum doublets or platinum based doublets and non platinum doublets. لكن دائما if there is no contraindication to use a platinum base, they are the first line. Okay. Today we will talk about stage three disease. If you recall in staging, stage three disease means relatively larger tumors and involvement of both contralateral and absolateral lymph nodes. Hello, stage three disease, we, we divide into stage three A and three B, okay? Hello, بشكل عام, stage three B, especially advanced stage three B, okay? This is little bit treated as we have metastatic stage 4 disease. يعني إحنا بنعتبر إنه an advanced stage 3B presentation is um, potentially incurable and uh, potentially we treat with, with palliative intention. ما بنعتبر إنه the disease here is really curable in, in, in general. وإنه the management will follow the, the, the same um, guidelines and protocols in stage 4 disease, which is a metastatic disease, okay? Hello, in the stage 3A disease, okay, here we have to decide whether we can resect the tumor or not. Can we do surgery or not, okay? So in some cases, stage 3A, non-small cell lung cancer, is resectable, okay? And in some cases, it's not resectable. إحنا حكينا إنه we have three uh, treatment modalities. يعني we have the options to go to surgery, radiation, and systemic chemotherapy in the non-metastatic or non-advanced non-small cell lung cancer. بستيج 3 disease لقيوا إنه the tri-modal approach. يعني do we do surgery if the tumor is resectable and follow with radiation and chemotherapy, or do we do chemo and follow with radiation and surgery? يعني the tri-modal approach. The three uh, 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 options together, are they helpful? Leo, we wasn't clinical trials and no, no. Actually, a trimodal approach is not uh, improving treatment outcomes. It might be detrimental. يعني ممكن يكون toxicity على المريض. أعلى إذا أنا بعطي المريض stage 3A disease a trimodal approach. فبالتالي الapproach is not to use to use. Uh, a bimodal approach with chemotherapy being an important option. شو يعني؟ يعني سواء كان المريض resectable or non-resectable, we have to consider chemotherapy. Okay. Now, if resectable, you might consider chemo and surgery or chemo and radiation, but you don't consider in resectable disease surgery, chemo and radiation. فإذا إحنا حكينا not a trimodal treatment. طيب إذا كان not resectable then you exclude surgery. You are left with chemotherapy with or without radiation. For example, chemotherapy, systemic chemotherapy, is always a consideration in stage three disease. And you might use with it radiation or you might consider surgery if the treatment uh, uh, is a can, resectable or operable, okay? Be stage uh, 3A disease. Two options, one of them is chemotherapy, okay? 
الستيج 3 اكشوالي او 3A ديزيز هي اكثر ما عليها ديتا كثير حتى بالكلينيكال ترايلز اف يو ار انتريستد تو ريد اوتسايد ذا بوك يعني شو ال الموست ابروبريت بروتوكول يعني في كثير ديبيت بموضوع ستيج 3 سبيشالي 3A ديزيز بيكوز 3A ديزيز از نوت It is not a, a local or early like stage two, and is is not also like a stage three B or four. Okay, but we need to more kind of more still, um, in a very solid, uh, uh, يعني very very good uh, number of studies. Because actually, we in the non-small lung cancer, يعني في عدد يعني reasonable good number of patients whom we usually already stage four disease or three B disease. فمعظم الترايلز هي معمولة على هدول المرضى، أوكي؟ فإذا أنتو سمرايز يعني ما رح نحكي كتير بالستيج 3A، it's a bimodal approach، chemotherapy is always used، if if operable you can consider surgery، أوكي؟ or if not operable you might you might consider radiotherapy with with chemotherapy، concurrent radiotherapy and chemotherapy. هلا الادفانس ديزيز از ريلي ريلي امبورتنت فاحنا لما بنحكي ادفانس نون سموس لانك كانسر وي يوجوالي مين ستيج 4 ميتاستاتيك فالميتاستاتيك ديزيز از ادفانس ديزيز اند ذا ذا اي وود ساي ذا ادفانس بريزنتيشن اوف ستيج 3 اللي هو 3 بي ديزيز اوكي فيعني انتو لل لل يعني للكونفينينس اوكي تريت او يعني هاندل فور اكزام اوكي فور كونفينينس هاندل ستيج 3 بي از ا ستيج 4 ديزيز اوكي هلا بالكتاب راح تلاحظوا انه سم تايمز ذي تيل يو ذات سم بيشنتس ويز ستيج 3 بي وي وي كان كونسيدر سيرجري اوكي بس ذس از ريلي something rare it's very unlikely يعني احنا لما بنعالج advanced non small cell lung cancer this is a palliative therapy and usually surgery is not really an option okay فيعني هاي الجملة هي الاكسبشن يعني عادة most patients in stage 3b um, the tumors are not operable okay فبالتالي احنا بنعتبر انه stage 3b um, especially in advanced scenario هو مش operable وبالتالي treated as a metastatic disease. So generally speaking in stage 4 and 3B the advanced non-small cell lung cancer by definition surgery is not uh, a consideration. Radiation is also rarely considered. Okay. We rely in, uh, يعني in, in large part uh, على a systemic treatment. This could be a targeted therapy or chemotherapy. Okay, يعني إحنا عنا بالadvanced disease now we have يعني expanded the therapeutic approach to include other drugs. We have targeted drugs now. Now we have biologics, for example, we have EGFR inhibitors, VEGF inhibitors, angiogenesis inhibitors. يعني عنا ALK rearrangement inhibitors. Now we have many drugs approved. in the advanced non-small cell lung cancer, plus we still have the option of chemotherapy. Lacking radiation and surgery as options in the advanced disease, they are really rarely used. يعني أحيانا ممكن يعطوا palliative radiotherapy. Very rarely the tumor in stage 4 is operable, سواء كان بstage 3B or حتى metastatic disease. Very rarely we consider surgery. فمعظم الدسكشن بالكتاب هو على the, the systemic treatment in stage uh, 4 and 3B disease. طيب هلا to, to decide the treatment in stage 4 disease or stage 3B collectively I will always refer to them as advanced disease. Okay? فكلمة advanced disease in non-small cell lung cancer means either stage 3B or 4. طيب What information I should know in the advanced uh, uh, disease to decide my therapy? Oh, yani what factors will guide therapy or treatment selection, let me say. Age of patient is very important. 
usually we say elderly and non-elderly, the above 60 or below 60. So age is really important. The performance status. I think the performance status is a variable um, calculated based on many factors. Okay, and in the end, the patient score. And there is a score usually from zero to three or four. The score correlates with the performance status. So when we say score O1 or 2, we in general, يعني, إنه, this patient has good performance status. So what does that mean? The patient can tolerate chemotherapy. They can tolerate aggressive treatment. They can tolerate combination. Okay. So the performance status can guide me about what regimen, what chemotherapy I should go for. How, how, how possible is the patient to tolerate? Okay, so keep in mind, in most cases, it's not a curable uh, uh, stage. But there is no need to go with very aggressive treatments to patients who will not tolerate uh, uh, aggressive regimens because eventually even using an aggressive regimen in patients with very poor performance status, very unlikely to reach a cure. Okay. فإحنا ال ECOG يعني ال ال performance status is characterized by an ECOG uh, score based on it يعني بنقول يا إما المريض عنده good performance status so it's either good performance status or poor بشكل عام a score above two يعني three or more three or four we consider that patient has a poor performance status uh, zero one is good to, to be honest, a little bit يعني, gray. يعني, if you read carefully the text, <laughs> two implies or تدخل مع range good. مرة حكي إنها range good. Okay. وهو شوي يعني two itself a little bit uh, gray, but definitely above two is is poor and below two is good. But the second factor is the performance status. So, love, let me go to the Please mute yourself. Let me mute you. Okay. Come on. Time. So, the age of the patient, the performance status, comorbidities are important. كل مكان المريض عنده multiple comorbidities, increase the number of conditions, disease conditions. The overall, يعني all in all, okay, response to treatment, the ability to go with, with more aggressive regimens is to some point impaired. فبالتالي إحنا بنعتبر إنه lack of comorbidities, يعني ما في عندي مثلا مشاكل. يعني المريض جاي basically يعني healthy, maybe except his uh, lung cancer. This is a different scenario from another patient, Jai B, B advanced uh, uh, non small cell lung cancer, and multiple comorbidity. Masalan, common scenario locally, Mazam al Marda, they have um, hypertension, they have diabetes, many patients have atherosclerosis, ischemic heart disease, Munkinikun and Masalan, cardiomyopathy, arrhythmia, yani, these conditions common, okay? وكل ما كنا عم نحكي عن يعني greater age in the elderly يعني we expect to see more and more of these okay this is a negative thing because يعني multiple comorbidities will impair the ability to go to a more aggressive treatment so بالتالي this is important factor for the consideration طيب taking these three factors together how we classify patients to receive chemotherapy نحن نحن نحكي عن الكيموثيرابي ما نحكي عن البيولوجيكس أو التارجتز usually regardless of age okay, سواء كان البيشنت elderly or not لأنه actually إحنا بنشوف cases in practice in clinic نشوف cases مرضى بيجوا مثلا 45 years old early 50s و they have metastatic non-sponsor lung carcinoma they, they do present يعني يعني metastatic disease مش دائماً 
او الادفانس مش مرتبط دائما بال... بانه المريض يكون elderly or above 60 لا بنشوفه ب relatively young age ممكن ينشاف في الاربعينات مثلا ف regardless of the patient age حتى لو كان elderly هذا المريض لكن good performance status and يعني we don't have multiple comorbidities يعني overall patient is doing fine all in all We can just go with the first line uh, therapy. اللي هو شو doublet, a platinum doublet. يعني هون المريض can take combination of two chemotherapeutic drugs. First line هو platinum doublet. Unless we cannot use a platinum, we go to a non-platinum doublet. بس إحنا بنقصد هون بالfirst line إنه we give a doublet, two chemotherapeutic drugs. Okay? طيب. إذا كان المريض عنده poor performance status. عنده comorbidities still can receive chemotherapy okay but not intensive here we go to a single agent to be used as monotherapy Yeah, and we start to see the deterioration in But confusion. zero one is good, and three and above is poor performance. Okay. Hello. If the candidate married and really, any above two, any very poor three or more. Several comorbidities. In this case, we might not go to chemotherapy completely. Can not just if they are administered chemotherapy. طبعاً regardless of age. يعني سواء هذا المريض كان عنده ااا يعني كان ال age below 60 above 60 لما بيكون عنده multiple comorbidities and really poor performance status three or above even if you treat with chemotherapy the response is not good it's nothing mathy any improvement so patients we advise them for supportive care sometimes chest radiation or lung radiation for palliative purposes okay based on performance status, comorbidities, we might not consider chemotherapy in the management of advanced disease, okay? Otherwise, chemotherapy is always a consideration with few exceptions when, when targeted therapy is first line. When targeted therapy becomes first line over chemotherapy. When chemotherapy is first line, okay? Okay, now we لما بدنا نعالج مريض نون سموسر لان كانسر ادفانسد ستيج اوكي وي هاف تو نو ايج بيرفورمنس ستاتس كوموربيديتيز ذا اذر فيري امبورتنت فاريبل تو نو از ذا هيستولوجي بالبدايه احنا بمحاضره الاثنين قلنا انه نون سموسر لان كانسر بيتقسم بيست اون هيستولوجي انتو سكواموس سيل اند نون سكواموس Group, okay, of of histology. When non-squamous, all now it contains adenocarcinoma and large cell uh, uh, disease. Okay, had all the names. How many non-squamous? Why non-squamous? Okay. Hello. Routinely, routinely, the pathology report. We are seeing, I mean, from the 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 data that will be there. إذا كان المريض نون سموسر لان كانسر، we we must find in the pathology report the histology شو نوع ال الكانسر سب. هلا B stage one two and the three A disease okay نون سموسر لان كانسر. histology is not a variable يعني histology doesn't matter in treatment selection. ما رح يفرق معي شو histology كان if I am treating a case in stage one two or three A. Okay, يعني لاحظوا إحنا ما حكينا عن performance status في هاي الستيجز، أو ما حكينا عن comorbidities. Why? Because the goal is to cure. Okay, and basically we don't have targeted treatments that might work in certain histology but not the other, or we don't use a certain chemotherapy that might work in certain histology or not the other. 
لكن بالادفانس ديزيز وي هاف تو انسر ذا كويستشن اوف هيستولوجي وي شود نو ذا هيستولوجي اوكي فالتريتمنت مقسومه حسب الهيستولوجي فاول بارت رح نحكي وات اف patient has advanced non-small lung cancer of squamous cell histology. Okay. What is the first line of treatment here? The first line of treatment here is chemotherapy. Okay. Chemotherapy is the first line of treatment. What kind of chemotherapy? A platinum-based doublet. Yani hon bil squamous cell disease, advanced. We always go to a platinum doublet to start with. What are the preferred platinum doublets? If you remember the table I showed you, we have many platinum doublets, okay? But what is the best platinum doublets to use in first line treatment in patients with advanced squamous histology non-small cell lung cancer? We have two regimens recommended. GC, our cisplatin, gemcitabin, the other one we can use in first line here is carboplatin paclitaxel. So one of these is always recommended as a first line platinum doublet. Okay. Recently, recently we have another approved uh, first line regimen in which we added nisetumumab, nisetumumab, an anti-EGFR monoclonal antibody had a biologic, had a targeted therapy to the GC doublet. Okay, this is a recent uh, approach. Yani, if you go to the older editions of the book, biologics at all this squamous disease. Okay, but this is this is recent. Okay, the monoclonal antibody targeting EGF receptor. You can add it only to GC. Yani we cannot, yani you cannot add nisetumumab to uh, carboplatin paclitaxel because it has not been tested. But in, in clinical trials compared these two lines together. They compared GC alone to GC with nisetumumab. You, you know, if you add nisetumumab, the, the outcomes, the treatment improves. Okay? So, بالتالي, we have chemotherapy standard certain regimens okay you might you might if available you might consider this regimen as well okay what if um, what if due to some reason the patient could not use platinum based regimens then then a non platinum based doublet is an option okay but we still consider as an alternative we still consider chemotherapy بال first line treatment. فاحنا عم نحكي first line treatment. Okay. يعني أنا إجيت على مريض عنده squamous advanced cell uh, histology non small cell lung cancer. بدي أعطي uh, GC أو carboplatin paclitaxel. Uh, لقيت إنه عنده uh, he developed severe hypersensitivity reaction once I started this platin treatment. I decided to to stop. Okay. Now I want to switch. I want to choose an alternative. In the platinum-based doublet, the drugs were not available in the formulary of the hospital. So what can I use in first-line treatment? The very first protocol or regimen, what can I use as an alternative here? We use the non-platinum doublets. Come on, what is the, the best doublet? Okay. عندنا الجيم سايتب ان باكليتاكسل جيم سايتب ان داكسل اوكي جيم سايتب ان ويز اتاكزين هو ذا بيست نون بلاتينوم دبلت اوكي فالسكوان السيلستولوجي وي يوز بلاتينوم بيس دبلتس از الترناتيف ان فيرست لاين ذا نون بلاتينوم بيس دبلتس اون افريج وي يوز ذيس فور فور تو 6 سايكلز اوكي من اربع cycles as long as the patient is stable and there is no disease progression we we continue yani we started let's assume gc uh, two cycles we reassess patient stable come four or up to up to six cycles of the chemotherapy regimen we considered nisetumumab in the beginning yani naftarid my regimen to start with 
my first line regimen to this patient was the two months. My first. The three drugs from the first cycle. OK, once we complete four or six cycles of the chemotherapeutic drugs, we have to stop chemotherapy, but but we can con you know, continue, maintain, maintain nisetumumab as a maintenance therapy. OK, if you recall, that sometimes in metastatic disease or advanced disease, we can maintain a drug therapy. OK. In certain conditions, if you can recall the Mahakena and follicular lymphoma and rituximab as maintenance, if you can remember. The lung cancer, the advanced disease, but not in the stage one, two, or three A. We can consider maintenance therapy. Certain drugs can be considered in maintenance. But hala, be a squamous cell disease. If we start this regimen in first line, we stop the chemotherapy after four or six cycles. We can min maintain nisetumumab. We had to call continuation maintenance. So, the maintenance of lung cancer is two types. Okay. We switch maintenance therapy. If we continuation maintenance therapy, the continuation means that the regimen that will be uh, maintained the radiation the patient will take after the chemotherapy was already started and it cannot be found. We will continue this drug. So we call it continuation maintenance. Sometimes, okay, if you should call it switch maintenance, yani after we end our chemotherapy or our regimen, we switch to another drug for maintenance. Okay, the patient didn't take it, but after we finished the chemo, we will give the patient this drug. And so it's a new drug for maintenance. So we are switching from one treatment to the other. How do we switch maintenance? So in lung cancer, with advanced disease, maintenance therapy is an option. The drug used for maintenance بيختلفوا بين يعني they they are different between histologic types. يعني بفرق شو بعض the maintenance therapy لمرضى الكسكوامس عن مرضى النونسكوامس. The nisetumumab will be a continuation maintenance drug for the patients who have squamous cell histology. Okay? Now, as we talked about in the past, which platinum doublet is superior? Cisplatin, carboplatin. As we talked about, there is no clear evidence that one platinum is better. Usually, the selection goes with Maybe considerations of availability, administration, masalan, side effects profile is very important. Hala, before, uh, before anti-emetic treatment improved, yani, ehna, in the last few years, okay, il, il, uh, yani, sar the new drugs of anti-emetics, uh, yani, better management of, of uh, of uh, of acute treatment uh, or any acute uh, uh, prevention of acute uh, uh, nausea and vomiting. So, basically, yani, can the physicians, yani, ifad lo shway carboplatin, li anna less emetogenic than cisplatin, yani, mainly hematologic toxicity, yani, less autotoxicity and nephrotoxicity and so on. Like in with with improved um, anti-emetic drug therapy, okay. Um, now again, they they have shifted to use platinum. But both platinum and platinum, okay, have uh, preference. Yani in terms of treatment outcomes, no uh, regimen is uh, superior to the other. Okay. Hala, let's assume as as we said always in the advanced disease. Uh, disease progression is always a possibility. Meaning, ممكن جدا أنا أعطي المريض first line regimen, okay? و upon reassessment, let's assume after two cycles maybe or two months, مثلا in case of breast or colon, reassessment لقينا إنه في progression, which means إنه the 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 initial treatment or selection is not controlling the disease. In this case, we have to shift to the second line. طيب شو الأفيليبل FDA-approved second-line options in squamous cell histology 
We have many actually. مثلا docetaxel monotherapy is, is very popular بصراحة يعني هذا الدواء for, for the second line treatment in the squamous cell disease is, is really common. Recent, recent evidence, recent clinical trials show that if we add VEGF receptor inhibitor, if we add ramicurumab, okay, هذا عبارة عن molecular antibody, binds VEGF uh, R2 receptor, يعني angiogenesis inhibitor, they compared, يعني in a clinical trial, they compared the, the classical treatment, هي معظم المرضى بيعطوهم monotherapy of docetaxel, they compared it to a combination of docetaxel and ramicurumab. ليو انه actually ramicurumab improves the treatment outcomes. فهلا يعني خلينا نقول البريفرنس بالسكند لاين انه احنا نعطي الرامكيورماب مع الدوسيتاكسل if available and tolerated. Why? لانه هذا رح يزيد التوكسيسيتي ورح يزيد الكوست. يعني البليدنج ابيسودز ممكن تزيد ممكن يعمل للمريض كارجيلوباثيز uh, 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 and يعني له توكسيسيتي رح تزيد اكيد when we add another drug. ف if you use docetaxel monotherapy that's that's right يعني انا ما بقدر اقول انه هذا لازم دائما نعطي you can consider it to patients who can tolerate this combination docetaxel monotherapy is still an, an option okay A very common option and recently we have also immune checkpoint inhibitors اللي حكينا عنهم قبل هيك ب uh, باللينفوما وبال uh, I think also we mentioned بمبروليزوماب ب ب الكولون كانسر ال PD1 inhibitors حكينا one uh, uh, inhibitor uh, immune checkpoint inhibitors in general. We have two options here. We can either use mask. Yes, yes. دكتور الصوت بقطع كثير دكتور الصوت راح من لما من لما بلشت عندي البي دي انتاجون بي بي دي 1 انهبيترز راح الصوت اه راح صار يقطع كثير طيب ليت ليت مي ليت مي ريبيت ذس فاحنا حكينا انه البي دي 1 انهبيترز مونوكلونال انتي باديز اوكي كان بي ابروفد اولريدي هذول الادويه ابروفد Okay, FDA approved. They are approved as second line treatment. Okay, in squamous cell histology, you can use any one of them. Okay, hala el pembrolizumab as second line treatment is also approved in non squamous histology, but nivolumab is only approved as second line treatment in the squamous histology. We have to know the histology. Okay, the nivolumab as an immune checkpoint inhibitor can be only considered in second line treatment the murder squamous advanced non small cell lung cancer. Pembrolizumab as a second line treatment, you can use it for the squamous or non squamous histology. Okay, فهذا يعني هذا الفرق كتير مهم. Keep it in your mind. يرجع كمان على uh, البلاتينم دبلتس uh, اوكي okay. uh, في بلاتينم دبلت احنا حكينا عنها قبل هيك فيها الكاربوبلاتين uh, uh, مع البيمتركسيد او السيسبلاتين مع البيمتركسيد اوكي بيمتركسيد حكينا احنا البيمتركسيد uh, belongs to what family of uh, uh, chemotherapeutic drugs do you remember هو عباره عن شو البيمتركسيد Any idea? Or no, it is it is what? Classificate which a class of chemotherapy pemex? I 
أنت فوليت؟ ميني. أنت فوليت؟ yes. Pemetrexid is an antifolate. It belongs to the same family as no? Yes, yes. Okay. Will will pemetrexid be found in more than one tablet? Okay. And if we go to the table, Doctor, the sound is very loud. Pemetrexid. Okay. Yes. Yes. اوكي الصوت بيقطع هاي دكتوره كثير اي دونت نو يعني انا عندي الكونكشنز از جود اي دونت نو واتس جوين اون طيب خلينا يعني نحاول على الاقل نكمل للثلاث مثلا اوكي ميبي وي كان ستوب ذير I don't know what's the problem, يعني بس خلي خلينا نشوف إذا ضلي أطع يعني لتمينا, okay? فا ال 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 pemetrix that containing dots حتى لو فيها platinum يعني okay? Pemetrix that is this chemotherapeutic drug is clear on that it is not good to patients with squamous type. It's inferior. So, بالتالي بالتالي ال 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 options available عندي بالسكوامس سيستولوجي وفيها platinum أو حتى non platinum we have to avoid إنه to go to a pemetrexid containing regimen. Okay, pemetrexid is not a good choice with it in the squamous cell histology. In contrast, okay, in non-squamous cell histology, pemetrexid is an excellent okay. The histology is really important in advanced non-small cell lung cancer. What? For had a squamous. For the squamous disease, okay, first line of treatment is we still rely highly, okay, on uh, chemotherapy. Platinum doublets. We have some platinum doublets that are superior, okay. As alternative, we can go to anon platinum doublets, okay. EGFR inhibitor, particularly in stumuma, okay. Not any EGFR inhibitor, يعني كمان keep in mind. إنه أنا هون ما بقدر مثلاً to replace this stumuma with مثلاً جفتنب or lotinib. رح نحكي نا أنا in non-squamous systems, okay? Use the regimen as it is, okay? So I now have one biologic that we can use in the Second line, this is not first line. This is second line with docetaxel. We can consider which of R2 inhibitor. So the approval approval is restricted. And you cannot treat patient with a squamous cell advanced disease, you cannot go in the first line and use a uh, uh, nivolumab. This is wrong treatment. Okay, you cannot go in first line and use combination of docetaxel and ramicurumab. This is wrong treatment. Okay, that so you have to adhere carefully. لأنه شو regimens اللي بتنعطى first line وشو regimens اللي بتنعطى بالsecond line. يعني شو بالsecond line. If there is disease progression, or uh, if patient tried, for example, a couple a couple regimens or couple drugs and uh, did not did not work. لنفترض مثلاً إنه أنا أعطيت المريض GC, okay. ما صار disease progression, بس صار عندي severe toxicity with cisplatin. I could not manage, okay. Severe myelosuppression or nausea and vomiting was really severe. Whatever. It's not about disease progression or failure, but toxicity. Okay, you can switch to another platinum regimen here, which is carboplatin paclitaxel. Like if you give this regimen and again another toxicity or failure, okay, then we can consider what? We can consider a second line regimen, okay? فبالتالي الأدوية بأي بأي regimen أو بأي line هذا كتير مهم. الكلام هذا كتير مهم.
Otherwise, you are not treating appropriately. فبتكو تحفظوا بكل هيستولوجي شو الفرست لاين أو شو ترتيب الرجمنز بالفرست لاين يعني شو معنى هذا الكلام لنفترض أنا ما عندي بلاتينم بيز درجمنز نهائيا بالفارميلاري ما في المستشفى ما في بلاتينم درجز أوكي طيب should I in this case إذا عندي squamous cell advanced disease should I try a non platinum doublet first or should I go to the second line regimen first هون بنرجع ل ال 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 guideline guideline بيقول لي إنه هذا فبالتالي I should try and and you try يعني ركزوا كثير لما بتدرسوهم لأنه كمان بتفرق بين الهيستولوجي كمانس and في حدا كان عم يحكي؟ ياس والله الصوت كثير بقطع شيء على الفيرست لاين والسكند لاين ما فهمنا ايش حكيتي آه ما هو وات كان اي دو مين اللي عم يحكي؟ همام همام آه همام 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 اوكي ما هو يا همام وات شود وات كان اي دو؟ اي دونت نو وات شود اي دو دكتور يعني أنا ما غيرت السيتينجز يس احنا ممكن نرجع نسمع الريكورد ممكن نرجع نسمع الريكورد بس حاليا احنا مش فاهمين شيء يعني مش قادرين نركز معك I really don't know what's wrong يعني طب خلينا نكمل النون سمول سيل لانج هيستولوجي نمشي فيه شوي يعني اوكي يعني هو بيقطع على طول الوقت ولا فيك يكون اوكي كلير بعدين بيقطع يعني مش سامين ولا شيء نهائي ولا ولا احيانا بيقطع شوي وبعدين بيقطع بكون شوي واضح بعدين بيقطع اوكي طيب I I will try to at least finish at three thirty okay or ممكن المحاضرة الجاية شوي هيك يعني I hope إنه ما بعرف إني what can I do in the settings but let's hope إنه next time the voice is is clear and things are better يعني حاول ما يعني ما أكم ما أكمل اللي بدي يا اليوم بس خلينا نحاول نخلص على الأقل ل ل three thirty okay ارجعوا اسمعوا المحاضرة please يعني وإذا في أي شيء مش واضح، uh, we can rediscuss it. Okay, we, we, I can repeat it for you. ما في مشكلة. سامعيني هلا؟ آه دكتور طيب، يعني أنا اللي كنت بحكي لما تدرسوا chapter lung cancer، دبوا كثير على what drug therapy used in the squamous histology, what drug therapy in non-squamous. What drug therapy is first line? What drug therapy is second line? They are not interchangeable. You cannot switch between. Okay. طيب هلا بالنون سكوانس هيستولوجي يعني if I tell you in a patient عمره 54 years old دخل على المستشفى لقينا عنده heart disease. Well, histology told me that he has adenocarcinoma. Is it squamous or non-squamous? Yes, Aya. Aya? Non-squamous. Non-squamous. Or he has a large cell carcinoma. Is it non-squamous? Okay, so if I tell you adenocarcinoma or large cell, you have to know directly it is non-squamous. I will say that it is non-squamous and it is non-squamous regardless of if it is adenocarcinoma or large cell. Okay, right. So if in both cases, both cases, okay.
طول المسج حدا بيطلع من المحاضرة حدا بيطالع من المحاضرة يا رانيا دكتورة أنا صار نضل أنا أربع مرات من المحاضرة لا أنا عاملة دي اكتيفيشن ما في طفل بيقدر يعمل كنترول على اني ثينك ما حدا بيقدر يطلع حدا اي ام شور اوف ذات مي اتس ذا كونكشن ولا مكتوب لك مسج انه طالب طلعك ولا ذس كونكشن لا انا اكيد انه نو ستودنت كان في مسج لا لا دكتورة اه لا لانه انا اي فيست يعني فادي 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 موجود إذا حدا ما طلع فادي إذا ما حدا عارف يطلع الثاني يا فادي أيوة <تصفيق> على الأغلب يا رانيا it's it's being disconnected أوكي okay. طيب خلينا نرجع على ال ال non small cell lung cancer of non squamous histology advanced disease أوكي okay. Here we have to ask one important question before we decide if we should start chemotherapy or targeted therapy. لأنه هون targeted therapy ممكن تكون first line. It might come superior. Okay. فأنا لازم أعرف. Okay. One. يعني I have to answer one important thing. Do I have specific mutations or not? إذا بتتذكروا محاضرة the introduction to lung cancer. قلنا. إنه بالأدينو كارسينوما بارتيكيلرلي أوكي which is like fifty percent of the cancers in non small cell lung في عنا two important genetic findings or abnormalities one has to do with mutations in the EGFR receptor بالكنيز دومين والثانية حكينا EML ALK rearrangement أوكي فعادة المريض اللي بيجي non squamous disease Advanced non-small cell lung cancer. We do genotyping for EGFR receptor, and we look at two important mutations. Okay. هلا بغض النظر عن التفاصيل بغض النظر عن تفاصيل the mutation or the exons. Okay. في إشي بنقول له favorable EGFR mutation. شو يعني كلمة favorable؟ بحكي this is a a favorable mutation. بحكي مثلاً exon 19 mutation is a favorable mutation. What does that mean? يعني is it something good to find this mutation in the EGFR uh, receptor in the kinase domain or not? Yeah, this is advantage to find in, in a patient with a, a, a non-squamous histology or not? Actually, favorable means it's something good, okay? فا فا إحنا هون لما بندور على ال mutations بال EGFR receptor, we do this only in the non-squamous histology. يعني المريض اللي بيجي squamous disease, we we don't check. And in the squamous disease, it's very rare to find these mutations, the EGFR mutations or the ALK rearrangement. So we don't do this in squamous disease. This is we do only in the advanced and non-squamous non-Muslim. Okay, so is advanced of non-squamous histology. We we proceed. Bin dawar is a fiend favorable EGFR mutations or ALK rearrangements. One of them. Sometimes we can find both actually. Okay, طيب. If the if the uh, يعني, uh, the outcome or can a report, for example, the genotyping, in no yes, we do have uh, an EGFR uh, favorable mutation. One of these target mutations. This is an advantage. Why? Because in this case, we can consider targeted EGFR inhibitors to treat this patient in first line of treatment, and we can skip chemotherapy. Okay. يعني إحنا بهاي الحالة قاعدين بندور على هاي الميوتيشنز if they exist. Why? If they exist, it means that the patient response will be great to EGFR tyrosine kinase inhibitors and so we have to start these in first line treatment. طيب إذا لقينا إنه في ALK rearrangement ال EML ALK rearrangement هو يعني يبان عن translocations in the DNA فا we we check for the ALK rearrangement with fish. I think you know what is fish now. Okay. 
فاحنا بنعمل فيش اناليسيز والريبورت بيقول انه اي ال كيري ارينجمنت اكزيست يعني زي موجودين بالسيل اور نوت بالكانسر سيل اور نوت اوكي ناو اف وي هاف بوزيتيف اي ال كي ري ارينجمنت اور ذا اي ال كي ري ارينجمنت دو اكزيست We also have a group of ALK inhibitors, rearrangement inhibitors, uh, certain drugs by yani, uh, small molecule inhibitors. We also start these in first line treatment. So, if I am a patient with non-squamous advanced disease of non-small cell lung cancer, um, how many groups do you think we can put the patient in? Any kind of group of, of patients I can have is I have non-squamous disease. يعني خلينا نقول خلينا نعتبر انه احنا we are playing a game of probability. What's the probabilities here? شو الاوبشنز عندي؟ If you want to categorize or stratify the patients in the non-squamous advanced disease from the beginning. شو ممكن يكون عندي الـ probability؟ ممكن يجي المريض عنده EGFR uh, 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 Mutations, favorable mutations. ممكن يجي الأوبشن الثاني إنه يكون عنده AL carry arrangement. ممكن يجي عنده EGFR mutation and AL carry arrangement. وممكن يجي no EGFR mutation, no AL carry arrangement. None of these mutations or arrangement exists. Wild type EGFR, AL carry arrangement is negative. مش هاي الاوبشنز الموجودة عندنا ممكن انه احنا نلاقيها رايت؟ right? طيب if we have if we have EGFR favorable mutations as I said okay first line treatment is an EGFR inhibitor what kind of inhibitors احنا حكينا ال ال EGFR او التايرسين uh, يعني receptor tyrosine kinase inhibitors ممكن يكونوا monoclonal antibodies okay like مثلا if you remember بالكولون حكينا عن cetuximab حكينا عن ال ال panitumumab قبل شوي بالسكوامس disease حكينا عن النسيتومومب monoclonal antibodies with the other class of Uh, tyrosine kinase inhibitors, uh, 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 receptor inhibitors, are mainly small molecule inhibitors. Simply, they inhibit the kinase domain, the tyrosine kinase domain. Okay? If you remember, حكينا عن اللباتنك مثلاً بالبرست كانسر. If you remember, okay? هلا, in the non-squamous advanced non-small cell lung cancer, if we have a favorable EGFR mutation, okay, a first line of treatment is A small molecule first line EGFR tyrosine kinase inhibitor. Liano, high adwe, this a class of drugs is classified in two drugs, small molecule inhibitors that are approved as first line EGFR tyrosine kinase inhibitors. And we have other drugs that are approved in second line treatment. Yani had al marid, ilibiji, non squamous histology. With EGFR favorable mutations positive, the first line EGFR inhibitor that you can use is one of these three. Okay? Jafatinib, Erlotinib, or Afatinib. Hadol it talate, homme ibaran, ibaran, small molecule tyrosine kinase inhibitors of EGFR receptor approved as first line treatment. To patients in non-squamous EGFR mutation positive advanced non-small cell lung cancer, you can start any of these as first line, and you can hold chemotherapy. You can skip chemotherapy. We don't need to go with chemotherapy. طيب لنفترض إجا مريض وكان candidate. أنا أعطيته إرلاتنب. Actually, إرلاتنب هو يعني ال prototype وهو يعني the most used. Okay. Jafatinib followed, Afatinib who were yani, the, the very recent. Afatinib bifre'anhum, it is an irreversible tyrosine kinase uh, inhibitor. Jafatinib and Erlotinib are irreversible uh, small molecule inhibitors. In terms of, of outcomes, efficacy, uh, they are comparable. Ma bifre'u. Yani, ma bifre'u is a can the first line inhibitor who were Uh, uh, irreversible inhibitor or irreversible. Okay. لكن أنا بقول إنه يعني the empiric experience is 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 mostly associated with erlotinib or 
جفتنا فيوجوال يعني بالفيرست لاين وي يوز ايذر جفتنب او ارلاتنب بات يوزنج افاتنب از نوت ترو لانه كمان هو ابروفد ان فيرست لاين تريتمنت بات وي وي سامس سيف ات راح احكي ابدا I think Erlotinib. How long should I keep Erlotinib? I mean, why do you think the patient should take Erlotinib? In your opinion? Any idea? Can you guess? Had a man can you to guess? Of course, this drug is already available. Small molecule inhibitors. And as long as the disease is stable and there is no progression and uh, the treatment is tolerated, mafi toxicity, okay? targeted therapy, the goal is to give it on the long term. and switch. Is a side progression or Toxicity that cannot be managed, tolerated, and we have to switch. طيب خلينا نفترض إحنا إنه أنا أعطيت إرلاتنب وصار عندي intolerance toxicity to إرلاتنب. Not disease progression. خلينا نقول cannot be tolerated. Then you can switch to another first line EGFR inhibitor. You can go to gefitinib or afatinib. طيب لو انا اعطي ارلوتنب او جفاتنب وصار عندي بروجريشن فيلير اوف تريتمنت ذن ذن ذا بيشنت از ستيل اليجبل تو يوز ا سكند لاين اي جي اف ار انهبيتر ويتش از يوجوالي افاتنب اور اوزيمرتنب يعني هذول الدوايين اوكي الاوزيمرتنب بالذات ابروفد اونلي بالسكند لاين اوكي ف وات از ذا موست كومن ريزن to failure. Okay, again, point mutations, يعني عادة point mutations بالكنيز domain هي the most common reason to failure to the small molecule inhibitors. Remember, in leukemia, لما حكينا point mutation بال PCR ABL مثلا. Okay, this is يعني a very close scenario, but it's happening to the kinase domain in the receptor. ف المريض اللي بياخد الارلاتنب او الجفاتنب in first line for 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 some time the the targeted therapy فبصير عندنا بالكينيز دومين بصير عندنا point mutation very يعني very important point mutation هي T790M ال 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 الامينو اسيد على 790 ام بوزيشن على الكينيز دومين از از فلبت فروم تي تو ام اوكي وبالتالي ذس ذس ميكس ارلوتنب اند جيفتنب ان افكتيف ذي كانوت مايند يعني اي لوز ذا بايندينج اذا بدي ارجع اكشوالي على هاي الميوتيشنز اللي احنا حكينا عنها فيفرابل Why it is favorable? يعني ليش هدول المرتا اللي بلاقي عندهم هاي الميوتيشنز بعتبر إنهم candidates لهاي الثيرابي. Simply because in in this case the the binding in the presence of these mutations, the binding of EGFR inhibitor to the EGF receptor tyrosine kinase domain is actually high. يعني the the patient with these mutations becomes very sensitive. Uh, very responding to the EGFR inhibitor. Okay. فا إذا بتصير هاي ال mutation هون T790M, we lose this advantage, we lose this good binding. وبالتالي بصير failure وبصير ممكن a progression. طيب. We can still try a second line uh, uh, EGFR tyrosine kinase inhibitor. We can try a fatinib because clinical studies showed that a fatinib is active in T790 mutation. يعني إذا كانت المشكلة إذا كان الفيلير سببه T790 mutation, you can use afatinib. It is effective. Or or you can switch to ozimertinib because ozimertinib is also active in the T790 mutation. Okay. فبالتالي إذا كان عندي T790 mutation, I can use one of these. But I still 
I still shift to an EGFR inhibitor. يعني ما بروح على الكيموثيرابي بهاي الحالة. ليه؟ إحنا ليه بنفضل الكيموثيرابي؟ يعني إحنا ليه بهاي ال بهاي ال patient group عفوا بنفضل إنه نعطي التارجت الثيرابي over chemo. لأنه أولا the clinical trials let you إنه chemotherapy was not superior in treatment outcomes to EGFR inhibitor in this population. Number two, convenience of drug administration. And number three, the side effect profile, all in all, who we more tolerated, okay, بالنسبة للتارجت الثيرابي اللي إحنا عم نحكي عنها compared to chemotherapy. فبالتالي ما في داعي إنه أنا to lose the chance to consider a more tolerated, easily administered drug therapy and go to a little bit more complicated regimens or more toxic. فبهاي الحالة I can still try a second line <coughs> EGFR inhibitor. But what if? Pardon. <coughs> what if? Uh, I, I, I tried my second line treatment وصار عندي failure. يعني I tried two lines of EGFR inhibitors and the, the, the disease progressed أو صار عندي treatment failure. Then I go back to chemotherapy. Okay, I go back to the platinum doublet. Okay, وبال non squamous disease we can add certain biologic drugs to the platinum doublet like bevacizumab رح نحكي عنه. So you can use a platinum doublet or a platinum doublet with bevacizumab. يعني هون أنا خلص I consumed uh, my EGFR inhibitors. The disease is still progr في progression. لازم أعمل control فبروح على الكيموثيرابي. بروح على الكيموثيرابي. Okay. Uh, بالكتاب في في statement I think عندكم يعني in order to avoid confusion بيقولوا فيها انه sometimes حتى هدول المرضى اللي هم uh, advanced non squamous histology with EGFR favorable mutations we can start a platinum doublet okay you can start a platinum doublet and then switch to the EGFR inhibitor احيانا احيانا هذا بينعمل بالبراكتس ليش؟ احيانا لما بيجي المريض in this setting okay the patient is eligible to the EGFR inhibitor لكن لما بيكون the disease presentation is very aggressive you know EGFR inhibitors أو التارسين كينيز inhibitors يعني ما رح يعطوني uh, an, an instant uh, uh, cytotoxic activity okay ففي شوي delay بال, بال onset أو بال effect فأحيانا إذا إجا المريض at يعني really aggressive presentation يعني the clinical uh, case was really deteriorating very fast they want to control the, the carcinoma fast أحيانا حتى بهدول المرضى اللي هم targeted therapy uh, eligible ممكن أنا على طول أعطي ALK inhibitor أو EGFR inhibitor sometimes they try first to control the disease stabilize with with chemotherapy وبعدين بيحولوا المريض على ال respective target therapy يعني هذا doable in certain conditions but in general you may start just as a مريض candidate eligible you go with the with the target therapy okay حسب طبعا نوع ال ال mutation الموجودة في مرضى بيجوني non squamous cell histology ما عندهم EGFR favorable mutation ما عندو ال carry arrangement I don't have options straightforward with chemotherapy okay uh, ف ال 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 other potential أو probability إنه يكون المريض عنده ال carry arrangement okay I test fish analysis وبيطلع there is ال carry arrangement we have three drugs here targeted inhibitors only used طبعا هاي تارجت الثيرابي شو يعني؟ يعني only and only the patient is eligible. They use these drugs only if you have, for example, EGFR favorable mutations. We use crizotinib, seretinib, and electinib. هدول التلاتة عبارة عن ALK rearrangement inhibitors only if the patient has ALK rearrangement. Okay? The first line among these three هو crizotinib. فإذا كان المريض عنده non squamous disease okay with ALK rearrangement advanced stage first line drug is crizotinib now if crizotinib was not available toxic 
okay? You, you go, you stretch, or you move, or you can then try type or elective, okay? What if we filled two ALK inhibitors? Same thing, we go to platinum-based regimens, we go to chemotherapy, same uh, scenario, okay? Samin, uh, do you hear me? صوت واضح او او بقطع سامعيني واضح دكتور واضح تمام خلينا نكمل اذا اوكي ف ال 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 البوتنشال الاخير او البروببيليتي الاخيره انه يجي المريض ادفانس ستيج نون سمول سيل لونج كانسر اوف نون سكوامس هيستولوجي نو اي جي اف ار في variable mutations negative for ARK rearrangement. Here we don't have an option but to directly go to again chemotherapy. The standard is a platinum doublet, had a standard average of four to six cycles. To that platinum doublet, you may may not add bevacizumab. Okay, but if I decide to add bevacizumab, actually if you add bevacizumab, uh, it improves treatment outcomes, it's good. Okay, طبعاً رح تزيد ال cost with toxicity, but it's good. So you might consider adding vivacizumab. And if you if you decided not to, you just go with the platinum doublet four to six cycles. That's another option. هلا ليه يو بلي clinical trials إنه vivacizumab is not compatible with any يعني يعني not يعني ما عنا overall compatibility. يعني إذا بدي أضيف vivacizumab let you and uh, you have to add it with carboplatin paclitaxel doublet. It gives the best result. Okay. So, ما بقدر أنا أضيف بما معنا أنا ما بقدر أضيف البيفاسيزوماب بال 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 settings هاي ما بقدر أضيفه to just any doublet. Okay. You cannot add consider it just for any doublet. Okay. We have specific doublets or platinum based regimens. That you can add to them bevacizumab. يعني لا يو إنه أحيانا if you add bevacizumab to some regimens or doublets, it will not. يعني the outcome is not improved. Okay. ففي عنا certain regimens where you can bevacizumab. من هالكاربوبلاتين باكليتاكسل مثلا ممكن نضيفها على doublets containing bemetrexid. مثل ما حكيت the doublets with bemetrexid. Bemetrexid is very good to the non-squamous histology. It's really good. فممكن أنا أضيف كمان البيفاسيزوماب على البيمتركسيد كونتينينج دبلتس، أوكي؟ طيب. From the beginning, from the beginning, if I already have بيمتركسيد in my doublet or if I have بيفاسيزوماب أو أنا كنت أعطي رجمن فيها بلاتينم بيمتركسيد وضايف عليهم بيفاسيزوماب، any of these, okay, could be a continuation maintenance regimen. يعني شو المينتنس دراجز uh, اللي أنا ممكن أعطيها بالنون سمول سيل لانك كانسر أوف ذا نون سكوامس هيستولوجي يو كان كونسيدر بيمتركسيد بيفازيزوماب بوث بيمتركسيد أند بيفازيزوماب إف يو ستارت إيرلاتينيب يو مينتين إي جي إف آر إنهابيتر إف يو ستارت الكيري أرينجمنت إنهابيتر يو مينتين وممكن أعمل سويتش مينتنس شو يعني؟ يعني أنا ممكن أكون ابتديت الثيرابي with carboplatin paclitaxel bevacizumab خلصت 4 to 6 cycles and then I switched to docetaxel monotherapy in maintenance or gemcitabine monotherapy for maintenance فهذا بنقول له switch maintenance فهو regimen uh, a new drug for maintenance has not been used فبالتالي we have many options in non-squamous advanced disease for maintenance okay be careful the pemetrexid حكينا بالسquamous عفوا بالسكوامس ما بينعطى لا بالمينتنس ولا بالدبلت البيفاسيزوماب is not added to the patients with squamous histology actually اقرأوا الكلينيكال فايندينجز كثير كيرفولي باللونج كانسر لانه لقيوا انه adding بيفاسيزوماب to squamous disease actually is detrimental it makes the the condition worse, it makes the outcome worse, it's bad, okay? So, with the bevacizumab, not an option, in the squamous advanced disease, 
اوكي الدوسي تاكس مثلا حكينا انه ممكن ينعطى سكند لاين بالسكواماس وهون ممكن ينعطى از مونوثيرابي از مينتنس سويتش مينتنس اوكي فبالتالي وي هاف وي هاف افيلبل دراجز فور مينتنس ان بيشنتس وذ ادفانس نون سكواماس ديزيز وعندنا سكند لاين اوكي تريتمنت سكند لاين افتر فيلير اوف فيرست لاين ثيرابي عندنا البيمبروليزوماب بس نوت النيفولوماب البيمبروليزوماب از ا بي دي 1 انهبيتور اونلي هو ابروفد بالنون سكواماس يو كان يوز ان سكند لاين داسيتاكسل بيمتركسيد اند ارلاتينيب از اي جاست ديسكاست وهذول الثلاثه كمان بالمينتنس وي كان كونسيدر ذيم اوكي فبالتالي وي هاف ماني اوبشنز بهدول المرضى اوكي طيب اي ويل I will I will stop here. ما رح نروح على small cell lung cancer. خلينا نوقف هون. Okay. We will we will complete it next time. إن شاء الله. Let me. لو سمحتوا ما حدا يطلع. طيب uh, uh, I am done for today. Um, I will see you إن شاء الله next week. اللي بحب يطلع uh, you may go. Okay. Um, because of, of quality of connection أنا بفضل إنه إذا في أسئلة خلينا ناخذ هالأسبوع الجاي. Okay. فإن شاء الله الاثنين الجاي if you have questions I will take it. Uh, بشوفكم ان شاء الله الاسبوع الجاي هوفلي وي هاف ا بيتر كونكشن يا